following contest is your main event of the evening. It is scheduled for one fall. And we saw a little bit earlier, Hendrickson and Ethan Hunter interrupting just five it. And now we, we're going to figure Introducing out. Introducing first, from Shreveport, Louisiana, Houston Hendricks and his tag team partner, the British sharpshooter, Ethan Hunter. We're going to figure out who will be the number one contenders for the new Texas Pro Tag Team Champions and who will face the Dream Team at Already Platinum on Sunday, August the 25th at the Campbell Hall in Pasadena. Well, we just saw the new Texas Pro Tag Team Champions in action. And quite frankly, I wouldn't want to take them on. Not right now. I mean, they're, they're firing at all cylinders. Absolutely. You no, know, these are two great teams, but the Dream Team is the champions for a reason, but if Just Five gets on the same page, hell, if Hendricks and Ethan Hunter are on the same page, we're gonna have new number one contenders and new well, champions. Well, they're obviously wrong. on the same page there. You see that? Helping Houston Hendricks with his probably soaking wet jacket. Just Nick and Kenny Topso just vibing. And you gotta wonder, Dan, is Kenny Clipso and Just Nick on the same page right now? We didn't really figure out what was happening between those two before Hendricks and, and Ethan Hunter interrupted, and you just gotta wonder, are they on the same page? Well, you know, Just Nick brought up a lot of great points over the past couple of months. You know, both of these gentlemen held the Texas Contender Series Championship. They beat each other for the Texas Contender Series Championship. When Kenny Calypso won that belt and watched the throne, Just Nick extended his hand in a handshake. They hugged it out. They were brothers. Four days later, Just Nick won that championship back. Kenny Calypso sulked to the back. And then, when Just Nick needed Kenny Calypso the most, when he was defending his Texas Contender Series Championship against Ponderone, who he thought was his friend, Kenny Calypso exited the building before that match started. Because once again, Kenny Calypso was sulky because he lost a title opportunity, so. I, I think that it was just a spirit of competition. Kenny Calypso was just disappointed and upset with himself. Let his emotions get the best of him, and, and they've made up since then. I don't think it I was think as Kenny's big a deal. I think Kenny's a sore loser. I don't think it's that big of a deal. I don't think Kenny appreciates the friendship he has with Just Nick the same way that Just Nick appreciates the friendship he has with Kenny Calypso. Did you not see the way he defended his honor last week against Sean Hendricks? He beat Sean Hendricks from pillar to post for his friend Just Nick. I think Kenny was just upset because, quite frankly, the eighth day made Kenny Calypso look stupid. Do you think Kenny Calypso wanted to throw in that towel? He, we yeah. all saw it. You think Kenny Calypso wanted to throw in the Absolutely. towel? Absolutely. I don't believe that Absolutely. for one second. He was forced he to. to go home. He was forced to by that sadistic SOB Father O'Day to throw in the towel. And again, Nick can't hold that against him. He just can't. Nick said, don't throw in the towel. Kenny was more than happy to throw it. He was it. forced to. I mean, if, if he didn't throw in the towel, Nick might not be here tonight. Maybe that's what Nick wanted. The tie up here from Nick and, and, and Houston. And, and Nick donning some new gear here tonight. Uh, a little purple and gold. from the former Texas Contender Series champion. Beautiful. Northern Lights there. Houston yeah. Hendricks wrapped up here in an arm bar, close to the ropes. Again, we saw Houston Hendricks 
and Ethan Hunter work as a team to take out the Wind Dragon, Dustin Win here at the Tex Contender Series, and again, to be the final two on Team Inspire AD, and they worked as a formidable team, and to get an opportunity to win a, a chance at the New Texas Pro Championship, what many people covet as one of the top, tex, top tag team championships in Texas, this is a very big match for them, too. Absolutely, Texas Contender Series is all about opportunities, giving guys opportunities, and to get yourself a chance and one of the most prestigious tag team championships, not only in the state, but the whole country. You know, you're gonna have people just clamoring to come down here and show their worth. I think Huge that's... Japanese arm drag there by the former TCS champion, locking Houston Hendricks back up with another arm bar. And I think that's what Houston Hendricks and Ethan Hunter have done. They, they are two of the very top prospects in the Austin area. And they've come out here to try to prove a point that they are not just the best in Austin, but the best in Texas. And to win, to win here the Texas Tennis Series, that's a big step in showing that you're not just a blue chip prospect, but a top guy here in Texas. Big shotgun drop kick there from Just Mix and Houston Hendricks into the Just Vibe inside of the ring. Kenny Calypso tagged in. Big flying forearm. It feels like Just Vibe is on the same page here. Roll in. Double leg drop. Leg drop there from Kenny Calypso. Just a one count there. Houston Hendricks, big kick out, trying to stay alive in this matchup as Kenny Calypso tries to make a meet defeat. Pulled there, they had a kick to the face there. Houston Hendricks finally able to get something in, tagging in. Ethan Hunter finally could be able to get a piece in this matchup. Double line. Ducks I go think that was a Ethan set up for a back, yeah, suplex. back suplex. A nip up from Kenny. You know what time it is. Calypso elbow from Kenny Calypso. Is that it? Kick out at one. Ethan have to has to find an opening, but right now he is in no man's land over in the Just Vibin' section of the ring. Those double overhand chops from Kenny Calypso tagging in his partner, Just Nick, now. And as much discourse that they had earlier in the night, as much discourse as we just had talking about it, Just Vibin' is on the same page here in the early part of this match. They're on the same page because everything's going their way. Once things start to break down, once things don't exactly go the way that Nick or Kenny want them to go, we'll really see what the relationship is like between these two. I think these two have always had each other's backs. Speaking of having their back, look at Houston Hendricks right there. He lifted him up into that hot shot there on that top rope, and his, look, Nick's is grabbing that throat. Great tag team. What a tag team there. maneuver by, by the Houston Tea Party. Come up with that one? <laughs> that was actually Houston Hendricks there came up with that. Brilliant. You see why this is a Mensa kid. You see why, you see why he got a scholarship in Harvard. Yeah, I, I see. Again, these two, I, I've heard a lot about Houston Hendricks. I've heard a lot about Ethan Hunter there from the AAPW camp in Austin. It, again, two of the hungriest, two of the best up-and-comers in, in the Austin area, and, and I think two of the best in the entire state of Texas. Back break here. Tremendous amount of upside between the two. The Houston Tea Party. This rake in the back there of Nick. Referee Daniel not getting in there. Letting yeah. a lot go in this matchup, but you know what? It is for a number one contender shot. What do you what do you think a win like this would do for the Houston Tea Party here at New Texas Pro? Well, you know, they just came in. You know, relative uh, newcomers as a team, the New Texas Pro, we've seen Houston Hendricks here, Texas Contender Series, you know, for the last two years. And this could really give them, you know, that momentum that they need to really take off as a team. Oh. Especially against an established team like Just Vibin. Cover here. And what would a win like a win like this do for Just Vibin? I mean, I feel like for the general morale of that team, it's to be huge for him. Well, 
I think what would be a bigger question is what would a defeat to this diamond do to Kenny Calypso and Just Nick? That's a very good question. Kenny Calypso not extending as far as he could be to get that tag from Just Nick. Lacks I don't, days I don't think Nick was close arm. enough to make the tag anyways, and Ethan Hunter's got him grounded here. Just Nick trying to get some shots in there against just, Ethan Hunter. He just needs to create a little bit of separation here to get that tag to Kenny Calypso. Going for that drop, drop kick. Drop. Nobody was there. As the Brit here has got Just Nick square in the middle of the ring, throwing them clubs at his sternum. Ethan Hunter, very Billy Robinson-esque. I agree. Taking a part of very, Just Nick. Very technical for as long as he's been in the business. And Q said it just got that explosive Explosiveness that, oh, right to kick with his face. As Nick's able to fight out here. And Nick is in no man's land. He's got to get the kitty. Trying to fight back. Oh, the two teammates. Disc is forearm there to Ethan. Duck through here. Nick caught up. Houston Hendricks has that ankle, not letting Nick go. Oh, it's a gurry. And this is the opening it's gonna be that it. Nick needs. Oh no, Ethan Hunter pulls Kenny Calypso off the apron. Kenny one more time, not reaching as far as he could to uh, no, make that tag. No, stop it. Ethan Hunter there, timed that pull, and now, now Nick again is in no man's land. Excellent tandem maneuver there. This could put Nick away in just a two count. Houston Hendricks has got to wake up and make sure that Just Nick is not able to get to his corner. He has got to move back and get Ethan Hunter back into this matchup. But Kitty's got to get his head in this matchup. I mean, what have I been telling you? You know, he's got to get his head in this matchup. He's got to be able to. He's got to be able to get in here, and if he's not, you know, giving everything he has to get these tags, then you know, he's kind of leaving, leaving Nick on this island here. Kenny has been leaving Nick hanging for months. Oh, that's not true at all. Double cross body. Houston Tea Party is down. This is it. Just Nick could be going for that tag. <laughs> Kenny looking to Kenny steal the it. glory. He's able to get it. And here, here comes, comes Kenny. Kenny. Leaping back, elbows, and a drop kick to Ethan Hunter. Sending the Houston Tea Party to Planet Dread. What are the taxes there like? Pineapple Slicer on a Houston Hendricks. We got to cover. This could be it. Two count. My goodness, I thought that was it. That could have been a three in the metric system, but not here in the HBA tonight. Again, Kenny is tagging Nick back in. It's a little teamwork here, a little razzle, and a little dazzle here. No, wait a here minute. Here comes Ethan. Oh, oh. smoked him oh. off the top. Huge boot from the Brit. That's a big boot, isn't it? And they, again, they're not. Flying kick to that's a German, it. that's gonna be it. How did Nick kick Just out of that two. one? Just the two, I thought that was it. Oh, he's pulling. Ethan hung, hung up there He was hung up there for a second. Rip cord into the eat defeat. I've seen that from Kenny many of times. Some great tandem work by Just Vibe in here. Again, they're back on the same page here. Oh boy, what? Houston! Houston! Big drop kick there in the corner. Throwing him out. Kenny gonna go up top. Kenny Calypso! 
Alonso hogging the spotlight the Raptors. one more time. Oh, and tackles him right in two. Kenny and Houston. And Nick just ran into Kenny Calypso. What did we just see? Nick couldn't prevent Ethan Hunter from breaking up that tag. And now Kenny's getting in Nick's face. What's happening here? Oh, and he knocks Nick out of the ring. A this miss, could be it. A bit of miscommunication here from Just Vibin. Oh, and he takes out Kenny. This is gonna be it. What is he going for here? Spike pile driver. No! No, this is gonna be it! Oh my god. Dropped Kenny right on his head. That's it. Good night. Oh, and Nick in the last second. With a springboard able to for save us. that. As Ethan throws Nick out of the ring. Again, a Ethan to the outside, but he stays on this time. And this match and all hell is broken, broken apart. Loose. Ethan Hunter and Nick are throwing, throwing strikes, and Kenny and Houston were throwing strikes in the corner. Oh, a little miscommunication between Houston Hendricks and Ethan Hunter. Boba shot! Wait, Kenny's on the top! Frog splash! What? And somehow, Just Vibin was Here able to work together and squeak out a victory. Just Nick and Kenny Calypso! Just Vibin! Huge, huge win for Just Vibin and Kenny Calypso. And by all means, it, it does appear that, that Nick and Kenny are back on the same page. I, or maybe they just got lucky. Some people call it luck, and some people are just winners. And two former Texas Contender Series champions now getting a shot at the new Texas Pro Championship, two Texas Pro Tag Team Championship. cheering on his friend again. Great contest from Kenny Calypso and Just Nick. Wait a minute. Larry! Just five and hunking it out in the middle of the ring and everything seems sunny in Planet Dread right now. And so a sign of respect from Nick, sign of respect from Penny. And all that discourse you had earlier, Dan, it seems like everything is peachy here on Planet Dread. It makes me sick, Bartek. Hey, one hell of a night here on the Texas Contender Series 38. Despite all the circumstances this week, the people came out, the contenders came out. One hell of a show, Dan. Absolutely. Well, that's it, folks. For Keeper Bartek, I am Dan Miller for TTS 38. We will see you next time.